before, before, when I know no Jesus, and I saw so fear, passing the fear. This my life, oh, and I saw so wahana, till one fine day, and I am Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, show me the way. We have a new city out called Wake Up, um, and out of it I took a good follow which is an exuberant uh, declaration of my God, my Lord Jesus is the one that I'm following. And what a lovely fellowship it has been. Um, because uh, it's done in Pidgin English, which is very, very interesting. It's a very simple, beautiful uh, song that you can sing along to. Um, but somebody said to me, look, this is your best work yet. And I went, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> And then there is Arumba. Arumba was born out of a desire to do some advocacy work on behalf of our young girls in Nigeria who are being trafficked, who are facing all manner of oppression, forced into uh, prostitution. Some is from their family. Some find themselves in a situation where they're driven away from home they have no place to go, they are on the streets. Uh, physical, mental, emotional abuse. Um, you know, I just, my last assignment, major assignment was the DG of the National Center for Women Development. And this was my battle cry. Let's do something about the Nigerian girl child. <laughs> Them, Kosi was recorded in 2010. It's in the legend uh, CD compilation. Uh, there was the legend and legend reloaded. But um, we ne I always thought that the song was never fully appreciated. So it just came to my consciousness that we should do a video. Oh, it's a lovely video. A beautiful little church in Lagos. Uh, architecturally, Lagos is so blessed and I'm hoping that other people will begin to explore uh, Lagos, the real Lagos, the way that it has been for a long time before we begin to lose these buildings. And th this is um, one of those places that people looked at it and said, wow, where did you find this church? They're all here in Lagos. Goes on and started calling to his window, no, no crack, no request. Will he not find? Cause he owns all I did the IDP song while I was DG. So it never stopped because I look at uh, my life and the talents that God has blessed me with. And it's not just for Nyeko when to say, oh, well, look at me, I can sing, I can dance so great. It's for me to take it as a mission, a ministry, to say, what can I do with this wonderful voice and the ability to write songs? Can I use it to draw attention to issues that can better society? That's the way it works for me. So it never really stop. Besides, they weren't paying me very well. And just, <laughs> you know, but seriously, it never stopped. So I never went off the radar. Okay, I slowed down a bit. You, you could say that because the work as DG was quite involving, but it never stopped. you can do. If you can't do it yourself, give money, give attention, give encouragement, uh, monitor what is happening around you, even in your own family, and also be, be, be uh, a mentor. 
to these young girls. I have many of them that I, I mentor and I always have time for the girl child. I think they did a great uh, job. I was all for it, you know. Um, it's good that they are looking at our... We, we have music that is never dying, never goes out of style. It, that's a gift. And for these young people to come up and say they want to sample, go ahead. Do it uh, not just for yourself, but do it as what I've described before, a gift you've been given for the good of society. And never, ever believe that you are all that. Always know that you can get better, you can learn more. Leave your own self open to always learn from somebody, could be a younger person, could be an older person, it could be the circumstances of what is happening around you, but know where the music and the gift came from. God gave it to you for a reason. If you have all this, believe me, it can never stop because God as your source of inspiration can never stop. He can never, God can never run out of ideas. He is the copyright owner, the ultimate copyright owner of everything. And I tell people when I go into the studio, sometimes, most times, I have no idea what I'm going to do. And I go in there and I pray, I fully ask God to help me. And what happens is we download from him. And that's why I have to quickly, my producer knows, to quickly record it. Because if you don't, I do not know the song that I'm singing. So I have to go back and now learn the song. Like everybody else, I sit back and enjoy what God has blessed us with. So have that at the back of your mind. You are never quite there. Like, just like life, it's an unfolding drama. It's, you, you are always growing. Don't ever feel you've achieved everything. And now you are the best, you are the greatest, you are this. You know, I see our young people eating dollar, do, doing, you know, doing all kinds of things and showing them, say, calm down, slow down, know why and what this is all about so that you can have a long life in what you're doing. Jesus Christ, I will follow. Anywhere you take, my Jesus stay there. Anything you do, he go help you. Hello, my name is Onyeka Omenu, and you are watching On The Town on TBC News.